The humanoid robot race is accelerating fast, and two names are getting serious attention right now, Engine AI T-800 and Unitree G-1. At first glance, they may look similar, but in reality, they represent two very different philosophies in humanoid robotics. Engine AI T-800 is clearly built with power in mind. Its movements are aggressive, forceful, and intentionally dramatic. In recent demonstrations, the T-800 shows high-impact kicks, fast stance changes, and strong recovery after sudden motion. These aren't just flashy actions. They reveal something important. This robot is designed to remain stable even when large forces are applied to its body. What makes the T-800 impressive is how it handles imbalance. When it strikes or shifts its weight abruptly, it doesn't hesitate or freeze. It corrects itself instantly, using full body coordination rather than isolated joint control. This suggests Engine AI is prioritizing whole body dynamics, impact tolerance, and control under stress. Key traits for robots intended for security training, physical simulations, or demanding industrial environments. Unitree G1, on the other hand, takes a very different approach. Instead of raw power, the G1 focuses on movement intelligence. Its walking, running, crouching, and turning motions are smooth, efficient, and almost human-like. Every transition feels planned, controlled, and optimized for balance and energy efficiency. The G1 doesn't rely on explosive actions. Instead, it excels at consistency. It adapts quickly to motion changes, maintains rhythm during movement, and recovers gracefully from instability. This level of refinement shows Unitree's deep experience in legged robotics, motion planning, and real-time feedback control. And quick pause here. If you enjoy deep, no-hype breakdowns like this, make sure you subscribe to RoboFrontier, because this space is moving fast. Now, when people talk about robot fighting, the Engine AI T-800 naturally stands out. Its kicks, fast pivots, and aggressive posture give it an edge in combat-style demonstrations. In a direct, physical confrontation scenario, the T-800's strength-focused design would likely dominate. But fighting isn't the ultimate goal for humanoid robots. In real-world environments, factories, labs, warehouses, or human spaces, movement quality matters more than brute force. This is where Unitree G1 shines. Its agility, coordination, and motion efficiency make it better suited for long-duration tasks, navigation in tight spaces, and safe interaction around humans. So the real comparison isn't about which robot is stronger. It's about what kind of future each company is building. Engine AI is pushing toward high-power humanoids that can handle physical stress and extreme motion. Unitree is refining humanoids that move naturally, reliably, and at scale. What's especially interesting is how fast both of these robots are evolving. While some well-known companies are still perfecting controlled lab demos, these systems are already showing confident, repeatable physical performance in open environments. And that tells us something important. The humanoid robot era isn't a concept anymore. It's unfolding right now. So the question is simple. Would you choose raw power or movement intelligence? Let me know your thoughts and stay tuned because the next phase of humanoid robotics is going to move even faster.